models for several decades now. I'm going to be looking at height first, size second. Not are they good looking. Everybody's good looking in their own way. What the hell? Everybody's, you know, they're, they're, hey, hey, hey. You, you're good looking. You, you're good looking. You're, you're good looking. Turn around for me. Honey, you got junk in the badonka dunk. You, honey, you in a wheelchair. Yeah, you, you, you in a wheelchair. You're definitely, you're like a five and under. But you're attractive in your own way. What? Oh my god, he's wearing like Louis Vuitton, a Louis Vuitton belt. Dude, I can't stand it. People who rate people's attractiveness, who wear designer clothing, they're wearing designer clothing because they're not attractive themselves. And it's just like, it's just this facade, it's this front that they put on to hide themselves and their insecurities. Yet they're the ones that, that are I, trying to identify other attractive people. I'm Putting diving too deep. Several okay. decades now. I'm going to be this dude's the expert. Size second. Not are I mean, I'm not going to lie, his facial hair is perfectly cut. I'm kind of In their own way. I'm just here to determine whether or not somebody can make money doing it. All right, okay. Go ahead and bring the, uh, the first person in. How's it going? <laughs> you dress really well. You seem <gasps> like you keep good hygiene. <laughs> I do. I would say you are my type. Give us a spin. Nobody comes out wearing that outfit and isn't trying to show off and make sure that everybody sees her. Oh, you hell yeah. You also seem very nice. I think a lot of people would see that you're like very pretty and maybe think that you're not nice. Typically okay, look, just automatically look, 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 just cut to the chase. Just cut to the chase. Just say you're ugly. That's it. That's all you have to say. You're a bitch because you're pretty. Yeah, yeah. pretty much. <laughs> Not a bitch. Would I find you attractive? Yes. <laughs> Probably a good solid eight. Yeah, I think you're beautiful. You. I would give you a solid eight. I'll give you a nine. <laughs> mm -hmm. Are you single? I'm not. Oh, okay. How old are you? I'm 26. <gasps> My son is around that age. <laughs> <laughs> I might know your son. If I do, and you're watching this, I'm sorry. I don't oh mind. my god! I'll be that milf. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me all about you. Dude, um, wait, okay, what? Wait, what? It, what, what, what? I'm sorry. What are the shoes she's wearing? Chat, chat. What are those shoes? What are those shoes? Look, I am no fashionista, no fashion model, by any stretch of the imagination. This guy's got kudo points because he looks like he's seven two. Okay, tall people are, you know, they, in, in women's eyes, it's automatically attractive. I'm, I'm, I'm like five eleven and a half. We will say six feet. This guy's like seven five. Okay, clearly. But uh, what? <laughs> Tell me all about you. Um, okay, I'm 37. I like football. I like Hell yeah, brother. Beer. All of these Hell things yeah. you probably would have guessed just by taking a look at him. What? I want to give you like a six because you're style. I imagine I he is a lead or a, a raid leader. Drawn to. I kind of he like looks like he is horde. Oh, I wish I would have like just rolled out of looks bed. Looks like he'd be really, really good at this. FPS. Oh, yeah. <laughs> like, if you want grungy and dirty, <laughs> like this guy. Is I'm sick. getting an FPS gaming a five, warlord. A little bit of work, he might be able to get some background work. If I was going to be watching a Bud Light commercial, yeah, I would actually look at him and believe <laughs> that beer is going to be tasty. <laughs> Thank you very much. Yeah, absolutely. How's it going? That's a yes. That works. No. You look like a model. No. You look like you were from like a magazine. How I rate. How attractive that no, this, lo this looks like somebody's like mother dressed him up, dude. He's even got the tucked in shirt. Have you ever worked in the fashion industry? Nope. Uh, Never even tried? Not, not, not really. Obviously, I have some work to do to get to there. But, you, uh, you barely have any work to do. That height, height, you that perfect. size, the muscle tone, broad shoulders, small waist, long legs. So everything is pretty much symmetrical. I wouldn't really lose any weight. Yeah, I'd give him a 10. Oh. I would give what? you a 9 out of 10. 9 likelihood to steal my girl. I'm going to take like traditional standards and mine into account and give you a seven. Okay. But that's just because I am attracted to losers and you don't seem to be one. Would I benefit from tattoos? Yeah, if I saw you with tattoos, I would probably rank you a little bit higher. I have a baby yeah. one. You do? Oh my lower. god. <laughs>
when you walked in, I got a little scared. Uh, I dated somebody that looked similar to you. I, uh, I was like, oh, fuck. I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, no, that's fine. It's not your fault. <laughs> Why would you even bring that uh, up? What the hell, dude? You that's how you make it awkward. Six. You're very, you're very cute, and I like the hair is very cool. And then if your outfit matched that, then yeah, I would rate you higher. So how would you change my outfit for you then? Just kind of like dress like a scumbag. I, <laughs> if she was in like a band tee. I like her. She's a degenerate. Bands. Girl in wheelchair. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> I would give you a seven. You thought that I looked kind of like your ex. Mm -hmm. Did that raise or lower my score? I would say it raised your score. What? Okay. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we used to have really good sex, so that brought our, my rating up. Okay. okay. I don't know why I disclosed that information. What? Ooh, I am slutty. Nice what? I love your style. Thanks. Why you gotta make it weird? Can you smile bigger. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, you have a really nice smile. I would say if you were gonna get into this industry, you would need to grow a little bit taller, <laughs> especially with the hair. It's a little bit on the severe side. But there are a lot of people out there that would book you for commercial print products, television, film. You seem very approachable. Like if I saw you at the bar, I would come up to you, you know, to start a conversation because you're you seem very inviting. I wanna give you a nine. Yes, I think I'm giving please. you a nine. This looks like something I XQC would wear. Well, like I could see like XQC wearing something like this, right? <laughs> <laughs> like okay, the jacket. Yeah, and sure the, uh, the sure striped shirt. Some. Single, married. I'm telling you, single. Not for long. I could see him wearing it. <laughs> when I see an attractive person, my gauge of their attractiveness is like, oh, and we were both going after the same person. Would I be intimidated? <laughs> You're an eight. Okay. Yeah. Sounding a little bit intimidating. Right? Yeah. You could steal my girl. <laughs> <laughs> Hello. Hi, oh Emily. My God. Hi, Emily. I'm Elena. You are gorgeous. Three. <laughs> I can't handle her. You're so cute. What the heck? Oh, thank you. She's one of those girls that when she walks into a room with a big old smile, you automatically will like them. Oh, no. Not sure about that. Oh, the no, 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 no. <laughs> oh, no, chat. Oh, no. That's the worst feeling. That's the worst feeling ever, dude. When people are trying to be nice, they're like, yeah, you know, I like your shirt. I like your sneakers. I like, you seem so bubbly and you're so nice and everything. It's just like a girl rejecting you. It's like, oh, you're, you're, you're so good at talking. You're, you're such a, you have such a good personality and you're like everything that I've ever dreamed of and wanted, but you're just not my type. <laughs> Oh, hair, get ready if for I had it. to go Pepe on laugh. a number of bookability, I'd go Chad, with about six or laughing. seven. I think there's certainly work out there that you could do. Seven? On my standards and society standards, I think would both probably be a ten. Oh! You're just very, you're traditionally attractive, but you're also just very, like... There's, like, confetti and fireworks in my head right now. Like, this is really <laughs> exciting stuff. Thank you! Yeah, so nice you're the best. You. <laughs> Hi. Hi there. Oh my god. This is a guy that you would see in a Calvin Klein fashion show walking down the runway and nothing more than just a speedo. Yeah, you're attractive. A smile? Yeah, no, he's cute. <laughs> the pants are just. What are you doing with those pants? I feel like I'm just wearing pants, bro. <laughs> Dude, this is what the TikTok kids wear. He doesn't even have his belt in, man. I'm telling you, what is going on? This gives me TikTok vibes. <sighs> Let's take a look and see how your walk is, and then we can determine whether or not maybe runway might be a good thing for you. Can you smile? Okay, a lot of work to do on him for runway. I would give you an eight. The okay. pants are confident. I respect you, I see what you're doing. Keep doing you. What you're doing is working. I think I'm gonna give you a, a 10. Oh, yeah. okay, all right. Oh, shit. What would you rank me on a scale of one to 10? Probably an eight. You have like a very like Greek goddess type face, like it's sick, but that's like not necessarily Guys, like in. the type of person I'm always looking for. Chat, he's in. Does that cool. make sense? Yeah, that was like the n nicest possible way to say that I'm not your type. <laughs> <laughs> all right. It's because she's in a wheelchair. Let's just be honest. It's because the girl's in a wheelchair. Feels bad. All right, we're good. Thank you. You have a nice day. And she's gotten that before.